Hello, how y'all doing? Welcome to Random Thoughts and Observations, Randy and Devil Productions. I'm your host, David E. McClendon Sr., and we'll get into our video in just a second, but first a word of prayer. Let us pray. Dear Heavenly Father, thank you for all the many blessings you bestowed upon us. Thank you for our YouTube watchers, all of our blog followers, all of our blog readers, all the publishers, publicists, authors, illustrators, merchandisers, manufacturer representatives, and others that we come in contact with via these blogs and these YouTube channels. If there's anyone out there seeking to find you, please help them to find you. It's in Jesus Christ, Yeshua's most holy and most precious name that we pray by the power of his blood. Amen. The Mental Toughness Advantage, a five-step program to boost your resilience and reach your goals. It's by Douglas Clydesdale Comstock. Now, this book is very well written. It's got a lot of information in about how to develop your mental toughness, which is another way of saying resilience, um, to develop how you respond to life's challenges. There's a difference between responding and reacting, and you can learn that in books like this. I believe he talks about it in this one. I'm not positive. But um, he does talk about different exercises you could use to make the way that you respond to life's challenges better for you to be less likely to put you into a, a negative situation and to help you bore with a, a positive outlook and to help you build on your mental resistance, your mental toughness or whatever. And the book is really helpful. A lot of different exercises, a lot of different examples. He talks about the Navy SEAL training and the whole idea with the Marines of improvise, adapt, and overcome so that you can face challenges. And this great idea is the way that the military builds the mental toughness because, quite frankly, if you're in the military, in some of the special forces, and the entire Marine Corps is a special force, but anyway, um, if you need to go up against challenges like our military go up against, you need to be mentally tough. And in some of the situations out there, some of the different uh, business and stuff, you need to be mentally tough. If you're in the medical field, you need to be mentally tough. And this book is very helpful with that. And the only problem, the only problem I see with this book is the, what they call sidebars or pullouts, box quotes, whatever you want to call them, uh, they're orange with uh, white text. And it's almost impossible for my old eyes to read. Now the page numbers, which most people don't care anything about, they're in a light orange as well and it's impossible to read. As a matter of fact, there's a couple times I couldn't find the page number when uh, I was trying to mark my place. Other than that though, other than that, this book is very helpful, it's very well written, it's very well thought out, it's very well presented, and we think that it would make a great addition to the books you may have already on mindfulness and setting goals and time management and that sort of thing. Hey, this fits right in there and it fits right in there very well. And we thank you. Wow, Gindy, good book! Oh yeah, Hammy, it's a very good book. I understand that uh, he teaches people how to be mentally tough. He does. He teaches people how to be mentally tough. Ah, uh, when the going get tough, the tough get going. Right. And when the going gets rough, the tough get rough. Absolutely. And when there's a mental challenge, you go bye bye. <laughs> yes, I guess that's right, Amy. Oh, cause I know you couldn't be mentally tough, cause like you're mentally gone, man. Totally gone. Anyway, people. You'll want to have this book in your library. You'll want to have this book to help you with uh, standing up to some of life's challenges. And we thank you. Bye! Ready to order? Click the link below.